Dachshunds, like all puppies, use their mouths to explore their world. They bite or, mouth, people and other dogs to get their attention. They nip when they're playing and having fun. They chew when they're teething to soothe sore gums. Puppies don't mean to hurt you, but can accidentally catch your skin and even draw blood. You can't stop them completely, it's a natural part of their development, but you can teach them how to behave. Before we move on with this video, you need to grab the free dog training secrets guide in which I have disclosed the deepest dog training secrets that professional dog trainers don't want you to know about. These training secrets would help you have a well-behaved, super intelligent, smart and obedient dog without spending hours in training him or her. Link to the free, secret training technique, guide is in the description below. How do I stop my dachshund puppy biting? This is how to stop your dachshund from biting or mouthing. 1. Make a loud noise. If your dachshund puppy bites or nips too hard, you need to say, ouch, in a short, sharp, high-pitched voice. This mimics the natural behavior of his littermates yelping when bitten too hard, and should stop him doing it. At the moment, he just doesn't understand it hurts you, so you need to teach him that it does. 2. Distract your dachshund. Next, you need to distract your dachshund with toys. Move his focus away from your hands and onto something fun. Every time he goes to bite or mouth you, put a squeaky toy near his face to encourage him to chew that instead. Rubber toys are your best defense against being nipped. You need to teach him that it's okay to chew and bite his toys but not okay to nip you. 3. Praise your dachshund. If your dachshund plays nicely with his toys, remember to praise him. People often forget this step but it's actually really important. He needs to understand the difference between being good and doing something wrong. The best way to do this is to change the tone of your voice. Calm and gentle for, good boy, and short and sharp for, ouch. Give lots of attention and praise for good behavior and totally ignore any bad behavior. 4. Ignore your dachshund. If your dachshund continues to sink his teeth into you, stop playing and ignore him. Relax your arm and let it hang by your side, and then slowly move your hand out of his reach. If you pull away too fast, your dachshund's sharp little teeth could catch your skin. Sit really still. Don't say anything and don't look at him. He's biting to get your attention so, however hard it is, don't give him any attention and look the other way. You need to teach him that biting and nipping immediately stops play. 5. Leave the room. Slowly stand up and leave the room for a couple of minutes. Don't speak to your dachshund or look at him. In fact, don't give him any attention at all. This is just to calm him down a bit before trying again. Once you come back into the room, you can try playing with him again. If he starts mouthing or nipping as soon as you sit down, repeat all the steps above until he gets the message, biting must stop play. 6. Use a crate. As a last resort, if your puppy's mouthing and biting is getting out of hand, pop him in his crate for a couple of minutes. Don't use the crate as punishment, and don't ever shout or scold your dachshund while he's in there. Just pick him up in silence and put him in to calm him down a bit. You could also put some toys inside to encourage him to play with them instead. This can also be helpful if you have guests over, especially if your puppy isn't leaving them alone. 7. Be consistent. Make sure the whole family or household is on the same page with regard to puppy training. Everyone needs to use the same commands and follow the same rules. If one person allows him to bite and nip and someone else doesn't, the training won't work. 8. Get into a routine. Routines are so important and helpful with new pups. Schedule your dachshund's daily exercise and playtime to prevent any pent-up energy making him too feisty and bitey. Giving your dachshund enough mental and physical stimulation throughout the day, should calm down his biting, nipping, chewing and mouthing. It will still happen, but should be a lot more under control. 9. Be careful around children. This goes without saying but, when your dachshund is at that nippy stage, be mindful around your children. Puppies can get overexcited and accidentally scratch or draw blood. So it's best to supervise playtime and make sure your children are careful around your dachshund too. 10. Teach the, gently, command. When your dachshund puppy is at that bitey stage, it's a good idea to teach him the, gently, command. He needs to understand what, 
gently, means so he's gentle around your hands, and those of your family. Once your dachshund understands the command, you can use it when he plays too rough or bites you. Dachshunds are smart so it shouldn't take him long to learn. Use the command every time you give food or treats by hand. Do you want to have a well-behaved, obedient and calm pet dog without spending hours in training him? Check out the first link in the description and download the Secret Training Technique Guide absolutely free. It is available for free only for a limited period of time. Thanks for watching the video. Comment below if you liked the video. Please subscribe to the Little Paws Training channel if you are serious about training and grooming your dog. Also, join our Facebook group where you get all the solutions to your daily doggy problems.